Hello everyone, Lau here. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to day 22 of Vlogmas. Yo, we are in the countdown, you could definitely say, because it's just like two, three, four, ba bomb or <laughs> three, two, one, ba bomb Christmas is there. Um, but as long as we still have some time, let's enjoy the advent calendar openings. So, that one, as I always say, it feels like there's nothing in there anymore, but there must be a couple of uh, more doors, because I also still have it until the 25th. So, so that's not one that I did just on the 24th. 25th is also there. But today is the 22nd. Third. Ah, 22nd. Oh, that's a chunky one. <laughs> You can already see it from the side. It's a very chunky one. Uh, so I guess it's not a pin. Hmm. Let's let's see. Oh yeah, it looks like something glittery per Ah these, of course, of course. These are the this is the biggest thing that I like squished into that calendar. They are earrings. <sighs> and as you might guess, they are from the same shop that I bought, also the other you know, earrings and the, the hair clip, etc. Because I could not resist. I took them off of the kind of back card because that one was too big. It didn't, it did not want to fit in there. But I could not resist. They are hearts. I mean, they're completely self-made by this, uh, by the shop owner. And then down there, are lots of dangly bits. And, uh, and they are pink and uh, red together. It's actually a combi, a combi combination that I do like. A couple of people might still think it's odd to pair like pink. This one's a really light pink. With, by the way, I'm wearing red and pink today. I mean, it's a little bit too stripy to really go with that outfit. Probably would wear something more um, like plain uh, with with those because like these stripes don't really match those stripes. But I love them. Um, they're big and when I first got them, I was really not familiar with this way of, you know, closing mechanism. I then I, f I mean, I kind of found out how it opens, but it's a little bit tricky to really get them in. I'm not sure if I remember which way. There was a certain way to open it and I did not expect that. And right now I still cannot remember how, how I did it. There, there it goes. It's kind of centered to the side, whereas I thought like this might be the opening here. So let's at least put one of them in. There they are. Yeah, I love my big chunky earrings and they are actually reasonable like, um, like weight reasonable they have a reasonable weight they are not super lightweight like I don't know these are super lightweight here because it's just a little you know there's nothing to it but I have a lot of like bigger earrings that really are pretty heavy which is okay I can live with it as long as I don't have to wear them five days in a row uh, I mean I always try to like mix it up with a little bit of lighter earrings like heavy not that heavy and then I can the next day I can uh, get back to the heavy ones but these aren't actually as heavy because this is actually just made of what would you call that polymer clay or something like that it's very lightweight and thin and then there's just the bunch of dangling uh, pearls which also don't do not have a lot of weight to them oh they are so cute um, once again this shop is where I got them kawaii shop on Etsy and I chose specifically this shop because uh, they ship from Germany they are from Germany so um, not a lot of shipping costs for me and not a lot of you know import fees or customs or whatever and um, they had a bunch of cute stuff so that's why I chose this one these were pretty expensive uh, compared to some of the other ones that I like unboxed in one of the other days um, so because they are completely handmade and there's so many little bib, bibs, bits and bobs to them 
but then I was like, okay, I buy a bunch of kind of cheap things and I can buy one expensive thing. This was, these were the expensive ones. Ooh, I don't know, no, I'm not gonna wear them today because it looks like there's <laughs> too many stripes, but let's keep it in for the rest of the video. Um, let's get to the My Little Pony calendar and see if I share chocolate with, uh, with Rachel. The 20, is it 20 second? This one looks already if it's kind of open already, but it's not. There it is. And <laughs> the chocolate immediately fell out. What actually is it? It's a Santa hat. Ho, ho, ho. And oh, behind the door, ooh, there's a whole, not really the whole group, but you know, four of the main characters. Ta da! Okay, then let's switch to the third calendar. 21st and this must be the 22nd. Feels very flat. So my guess is pony brush or something like that. Pony comb. Let's see, what is it? What is it? Indeed, it is! It's a blue moon comb. Co comb. So moon and stars. This is actually um, one of the prettiest styles, I think, because it looks so dreamy. There you go. You have the moon with a face and then three little stars and under this, you know, bow, whatever, this round thing there. The, what actually do you call that? I don't even know what to call them in, in German. I, 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 I don't know. Um, yeah, let's find out which pony this goes to. Okay, I had to get out a whole array of ponies because, again, I cannot really identify which color it is like exactly. But, because um, there are like three shades of this light blue that are very identical. One of them is a little bit more turquoisey, which this could be. If it was the lightest one and the most kind of turquoise uh, shade, it would go to powder. So that's very likely. Um, here you have seen actually powder this, uh, this vlogmas season already because I uh, took her out for um, you know snow photos because she is the perfect pony to do so with her snowflakes. <laughs> um, so that could go to her. It's possible this pony was released here, so why not? Well, not this version, I think, because this is like the um, you know glitter symbol version. I don't know if the Italy, probably the Italy version came, that didn't even come with this one, but like, yeah, possible powder, uh, one of the early unicorns. Um, it is also very possible that it is not this most turquoise version, but it is the little bit more normal blue, but still very similar to that one. Then it could be uh, go to Glory, another early unicorn uh, from a different set, like earlier than <laughs> uh, than Powder. Uh, but it says Glory 2, meaning the second release of Glory. So uh, I don't know which release I have because they they it's just the you know American release. They she was released in year three, I think, or two. Um, very early on and then like in 85, 86 or whatever she, she, she got a second release and the first release came with a shooting star brush in like pink and the second release came with such a moon comb so also possible because I still cannot 100% uh, say which color version it is so Glory is also a possible <laughs> uh, pony and then there is another, like a third color, which uh, looks kind of, uh, to me, completely identical actually to the like second color that I said it could be. And that goes to like three or four different ponies. One of them could be Twinkler from the, um, you know, from the uh, Sparkle Ponies. So that could be her comb.
By the way, I'm only missing one pony from the set. I'm only missing Starhopper. And I'm really like, I saw her like yesterday on eBay Kleinanzeigen. Um, actually for a reasonable price, like still expensive. But I mean, I don't know if she's now sold already. I haven't checked since like yesterday somewhat in the morning or whenever that was. Um, but I actually didn't want to spend a lot right now. A little, trying to save a little bit of money. That's why I'm just like, should I buy her? Should I not? Whatever. Um, yeah, Twinkler could be. Um, also to one of the second set, um, so soft ponies, Crumpet. I don't have that one. Uh, and actually it also says baby Schlummerlein, which, uh, or baby by by or baby by eyes or what, what, what is the, there is no English name. This is from a German set. Um, baby by buys. I don't know if that has ever been something that was on a card because this is one of the three, you know, nesting baby ponies. So the uh, nursery ponies, uh, very late release, uh, German exclusive, so really German exclusive, so not, not even European. Um, yeah, she also came with a comb in this shape and in this color. So there's a lot of ponies that it could go to. Um, so I, I prefer to, to call those ponies. It's the same set as Baby Hufelchen or Baby Playful that you saw like, I don't know, two weeks ago in a video here of Vlogmas where she had, where I showed you the ABC comb that she shared with, um, with sports time. By the way, I just um, uploaded a, or I posted a photo on my Instagram of, of those two with a comb. Um, and I always prefer to, to, to call them their German names because they are a German set. So it's like kind of stupid to not call them uh, the way they really, the name was printed uh, on the package uh, because I don't think that they were released on international cards at all. So with other languages, you might correct me but I think these are the nest taking baby ponies and this baby Schlummerlein. Um, yeah. Uh, was there another pony? I mean, I, I, I brought four out. Was, was there even another pony for this one? For this comb? Yeah, the sweet, not a pony, the sweet dream poodles. Very, very, very unlikely. <laughs> because I don't think that um, they were released at all over here because as a kind of a sideline of My Little Pony that was not very successful. Oh, my little puppy, my little kitty, da, 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 da. they were little sweet little animals. They were all flocked and for example this is the poodle set, Sweet Dream Poodles. Uh, where exactly actually is it? Uh, there you see it. I think this is the darker shade so so my gut feeling is actually from the way I think what I've seen on the pictures that it actually should go to powder. I think this is the most turquoise. I might be wrong because I don't have any of, of this um, shape in this shade. Oh, is it shape in shade? Uh, because I think I have a green one, I have a pink one. I don't have any blues of this. Okay, we have a lot of ponies here. Ta-da! Powder. Glory, Twinkler, and Baby Schlummerlein. By the way, which one of these is your favorite? Do you, can you actually choose favorite ponies? Like, I can't. If you would ask me something like, choose your favorite pony, I would probably just go with like my childhood favorite pony. Because like, if I see those, every one of those ponies has something special like obviously i love the glittery bits and bobs and the glitter hair of of the sparkle ponies but i love my super classic you know glory and and uh, powder and like she is so special she's so cute and she's german exclusive which makes me kind of proud because i'm from germany so like who could i choose a favorite of those do you have a favorite of those four tell me in the comments because i can never like choose favorite ponies like you have to choose your favorite child. I know everybody would say that. I don't even have children, so <laughs> I don't know how that would feel. Um, last thing for today is Mikuru's last package. Yeah, that's really the last 
thing from uh, the box that Miko sent for our enjoyment here on the channel. And tomorrow, as I said, I will pick another thing from my black box. And then on the 24th, we have something from Tommy and from uh, Sonia. Sorry, I wanted to say Silke and I was like, she is not called Silke. What's her name? Sorry, Sonia. Uh, okay. What is this? Ooh. Oh, what is this? Is this something? It looks super cute. It's a kind of a little playset. I cannot even see what it goes to. Maybe to G3, my little pony or something? I can't see it. I have to rip it open. I think this is G2. My Little Pony, isn't it? Yeah, it's G2 My Little Pony. How does that work and what actually is it? Oh, this is... Wow! I have to research what this set is kind of called and what it actually is and means, but first let, let's have a look at it. I'm 100% sure that this is G2 My Little Pony because like A, the size, then G2 My Little Pony has all of those wonderful like, you know, like embellishments over, all over their play sets. Um, uh, the uh, rainbow looks like the G2 rainbow and also it says uh, Hasbro the 1997. So, whoa. Amazing. So I do even have the matching pony to this because this is the canopy, um, canopy bat, canopy light bat. What, 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 what's the actual name? Just researched and already forgot about it again. Canopy bat with light heart, not light bat, because the pony is called light heart. I mean, I actually know that. Uh, that's actually one of the strangest G2 ponies. It's completely made out of, you know, hard plastic all over. Um, but you can like move all of the legs and also kind of the tail. I don't know if there was another function to it. Um, ah, yeah, here the head. When the head is like down, then you can like, ta-da. Uh, when I found this, I got this from flea market. I was at first not even sure if it's a real G2 pony because it looks so fakey-ish. But this goes to it. So it's like a bed. You can make her lay down in there. Ta-da! And um, I'm not sure how this top thing works because uh, I tried it now, but I it's kind of stuck. When you would pull these actually apart, there is a rainbow in between. Can you see that? Um, so you could also actually pull these clouds to the side and you would have this like, like sky over you with a rainbow. And there's another like button here. And I honestly also don't know what that does. Um, I have to read into that. Maybe someone has made a <laughs> YouTube video on it or whatever. Uh, maybe mine might also be broken because like this button here doesn't do anything. I can, I mean, I can turn it, but I honestly don't know. It still is stuck there, but it is so cute. Look at how, how detailed everything was. There's a little bit of, you know, stickers there that looks like you know, some toys, some pony plushes. Uh, then you have all of these. This is typical G2, typical of G2 play sets. These, you know, like uh, flowers, flowers or flower ornaments. Um, Back side is not too special, just a little bit of, you know, hearts. There's the cloud and suck. And then this goes through here, yep. So now it's like, you know, stored and when the pony wants to sleep, I mean, that, that's what a canopy bed is, right? Then you can ta -da, pull it out and have it as a bed. Can you actually, yeah, you can also still 
like like this. This is the certain way. Uh, Thank you, Miku. Like, I'm so happy that I picked this for the last thing because, like, the biggest thing is not always the best. But in this case, I don't know, difficult to, to choose between best and whatever. But, like, <gasps> and you found this at the flea market? Kind of jelly because I never find anything like, like, I mean, I have found pony things, but, like, not, never a pony play set. And I consider, like, finding G2 things at the flea market almost as good as G1 because, you know, also a long time ago they're from the 90s 1997 this one thank you so much i hope you enjoyed this over flood of ponies today again not mad about it not mad whatsoever so uh gonna try and do uh my my thumbnail now with all of my free hands which i just have two of them <laughs> let's see if i can get everything in frame so thank you so much for watching uh hope you have very very nice last days before christmas and uh yeah see you soon and may the ponies be with you bye